Men's mental health and the power of thought. Let me frame it up with two questions for you. Where have you been and where are you now in regards to your thought patterns on that? For me, I've lost homes, I've lost cars, I've lost relationships, and things can happen quickly. Now, in that thought process, I was in guilt, shame, self-pity, and depression, power of thought. Things happening fast with a change in mindset and positive thought process, here I am now, sober, in recovery, working out, have a solid routine, got my health in check, housing, all that stuff, making money, all that stuff is in check. Things happen fast with the power of thought. Now, the thinking has everything to do with it. It's more important than you realize, all right? Thoughts lead to your actions, lead to the feet feelings. So, and this is a little bit of bonus for that and the power of thought is the spoken words. So your feelings aren't necessarily a representation of yourself, okay? You can feel one way or another. What you're putting your thought to and those feelings is gonna be the representation of you at that current moment, but you can change your thought and your feelings in a moment, like super fast, right? Now, more important than what you're feeling is actually the words spoken to yourself, like your self-talk. If you have negative self-talk, like I'm a piece of shit, nobody likes me, oh, woe is me, poor me, Oh, like negative thought frame. Well, that's how, get out of that bullshit. That's not you. That's not a representation of you. Switch your spoken words out with daily self affirmations. I'm great. I'm positive. I'm worthy. I'm awesome. I piss excellence. You know, stuff like that. And I do piss excellence. Not only in if you were to give me a UA, like I have clean pee, but also I do piss excellence every single day. Hope that helps to re reframe in your thought, the power of thought in your men's mental health. Make it a great day.